What is going on guys? Grave here. Welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. And early this morning we received update 1.22. And all I can say is so far, so good. Everything seems to be working properly. As you can see, Harriet is actually at her tent now. I was having the issue yesterday of her not even being here and the tent was not even here. Like you could walk into the tent, it was like it was invisible. It was like it was still here, but on screen it was not. I have seen plenty of animals. I'm able to use my auto aim like normal. It's not grayed out when you aim over the animal anymore. Uh, the server itself is full. I have swapped servers and I was in another full server. I will say I went and ran one mission for Crips and when I came out of that mission, um, my server was then a, a solo server for around 10 minutes I would say and then it started filling back up. It was not like it has been over the last few days where you would get in a server and there's only three or four people with you. Everything seems to be running properly. The moonshine shack is out. You're able to move your tent around. Let's say we'll move our tent down here somewhere else so you guys can see. Um, everything has been running correctly. Uh, I can still get out my, I, I'm able to get out my hunting wagon and of course my bounty wagon doesn't say it's being summoned. And of course there's a workaround for that. I know a lot of people have been commenting about that in the YouTube uh, section and on a lot of my videos or in the comment section here on the YouTube videos saying you know you can go to your stable that is true if you do have issues with that all you have to do is go to your stable and you can get your wagons out but hopefully the issue itself has been fixed that way you don't have to do that that way you can just summon your wagon whenever you're out doing your just normal activities so let's move this camp over to the great plains and as you guys can see it's going to move like normal which is a really good thing uh this has been a massive issue as of late where the camps would not move the camp would you know of course not even work if you could get it to work in game, it was just completely broken. It seems like everything is running smoothly with update 1.22. I'm not sure exactly what they changed. I'm not sure if they rolled it back to, you know, the update when the Nationals roll was released. Rockstar has not made any comment. Rockstar has not had any patch notes. If they do make a comment or bring some patch notes out, I will make a separate video for you guys for that. But hopefully everything is going to run smoothly. As we all know, uh, after 1.21 was released, everything ran, ran perfectly. And then about two hours into 1.21 being out, that's when pretty much hell broke loose, I guess you could say. And the game started glitching out. Everything was broken. Nothing was working correctly. So I'm crossing my fingers, holding my breath, whatever you want to say, uh, that this is going to be the fix for the game. And we all can get in and start playing, doing our daily challenges. Getting in on this, of course, the trader roll. You know, there's bonus uh, money for a couple of the rolls this week, including the trader, uh, the trader roll. I'm hoping they're going to extend this considering nobody has been able to play really since Monday. Uh, you know, being able to play smoothly or being able to play all the time. You know, some people have not had a lot of issues, but the majority of the community has had some big issues. Now, I'm not going to say you're going to get on and everything's going to be perfect. You know, you may still have error codes. You may still have blue screens. I can say personally for me, in the 30 minutes that I have played or 45 minutes I hear that I have played, there has been no error codes, no blue screens. But as we all know, the error codes are different for everyone. I have had issues in the past where I have error codes nonstop and other players do not. And I have had issues in, in the past where other players are reporting reporting having these error codes. And I do not have them. But as you guys can see, everything is able to, uh, is, you know, you can still lock on everything. It's not like everything's grayed out when you aim over it. You know, it's not, <laughs> it's not like the animals are broken anymore. The animals seem to be back out in abundance like they were before the uh, 1.21 update. So hopefully everything is working correctly. Hopefully everything continues to work correctly and we can get back in and enjoy the game. Find these two new legendary coyotes. I have not gone after any legendary animals yet this morning. I just wanted to make sure everything was working properly while I was making this video. I'm going to go out and try here in a little while to see if I can find these two new coyotes to see if the legendary spawns are any better or if the situation is the same as it was, uh, you know, when the naturalist role was released. But I can go ahead and tell you, I can deal with the issues that we were experiencing when the naturalist role was released better than I can, uh, you know, deal with the issues that we've been having since Monday. But anyway, guys, I want to make a quick video letting you know that it is working properly and hopefully is working properly for you. You should have this update no matter what platform you're playing on. It was supposed to come out for all platforms from what I understand. It's supposed to be on PC, Xbox, and uh, PS4. I'm not sure if everyone's got it yet. I have seen some reports on Reddit of people saying they have not received an update yet. Just be sure you keep checking the game, uh, you know, starting it, stopping the application, whatever, to see if it will give you an update. But leave me a comment. Let me know what platform you play on. Let me know how the game is performing for you today. And, of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. If you are a subscriber, make sure you click the bell icon in the top right corner so you know when all my videos go live. If you have a chance to share the video, please do. It does help out the channel a lot. And be sure to check out everything down in the description. 
Uh, the community Discord is linked down there if you would like to join it. My Twitter is down there if you would like to follow me on Twitter. And also, the affiliate here on the channel, GT Racing, is listed down there as well. So be sure you give those guys a look. And I'll catch you all next time. Peace.